Oh, wow. Well, um, I started here probably about um, five years ago, I'm guessing now. Um, but we used to go all the way to London because I used to live in London and uh, we used to go and see the same guy over and over because he, he was introduced me by a friend mm. and it was just so nice to mm. see somebody that I um, could relax with because prior to that I'd always been nervous, bad experiences when I was young, that kind of thing. Sister screaming in the room next door because I didn't give her quite enough stuff. Old days. Um, and uh, we'd been seeing this guy for 30 years and he said he was going to retire. He was really young, but he said he was going to retire. And we were like, oh God, now what do we do? And a lot of the fears came back. Um, so whereas he'd got me quite relaxed, and my teeth were generally not good, so he'd done a lot of work. Mm. We were like, what are we going to do? Mm. Well, we live local to, to Whitchurch, so we looked around and we came to see the receptionist and she said, for nervous people, we have Shilpa, who is really good with nervous people. And we thought, mm, well, you know. But we went in and she was brilliant. She was absolutely brilliant. She put me at my ease straight away. She's got tiny, weeny little hands, so you never feel them going in. And so whereas I'd got in like this, by the time I came out, it was okay, I think we can do this. Mm -hmm. And my husband went too, and he always comes with me to appointments because he's very supportive and he knows how scared I get. Yeah. Um, and that's gone on for years, and I've let her do crowns and um, inlays and all sorts. And, you know, whilst root canal and things like that aren't fun, um, she always puts me at my ease. There's a lot of, she does a lot of calming things. Remember to breathe, she says, remember to breathe, which sounds silly, but needs to be done. <laughs> and it does help you relax. Um, and she tells you, if you want to know, she tells you what's happening, or she won't, if you don't, she's brilliant, been absolutely brilliant. And over the time, she's put me at my ease, so I don't even really feel awful when I'm going to the dentist, which a lot of people do, yes. obviously. Um, I, ha I had no teeth down here at the bottom, um, but very good teeth up here that weren't doing anything. And for the longest time, I've been eating purely on one side. Um, but it, it comes to a point where you think, well, how are these going to stand up? Because these are quite a lot of crowns. Um, how are these going to stand up uh, over time? So this year we thought finally let's bite the bullet and go for implants which we'd seen whilst sitting in Whitchurch on a little screen with a lovely little cartoon happy people <laughs> saying oh you just pop this little thing in here and then you pop this little thing in here and it looked really easy <laughs> so I said let's go and talk to them about this yes. and um, we entered into considering those and um, I met with Manish for the first time and he uh, he explained everything that was going to happen and uh, it was scary but uh, I really probably am more scared in the long term of just having to eat soup for the rest of my life because if these conked out what would I do? Um, the day of the operation was, I was nervous. I would not, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't, but um, Shilpa even came along to hold my hand. My husband was there. Manish was, um, you know, calming as, as he could be. It's not as calming as Shilpa. <laughs> Sorry, Manish, but you're not. And um, it went really as smoothly as you could imagine. I had my um, headphones in um, just to keep me away from any noise. Um, and towards the end of the operation, I was even moved to sing along to my songs, which I think people thought was me screaming, but it really wasn't. I was so calm that I could actually hum along to my, actually I could sing quite throatedly, but I don't know if they'd recognize that, as I say, from the screaming, but I didn't scream, honestly. Mm -hmm. um, and since then, it's been great. I've not really had that much pain, mm -hmm. 
it's been um, so nice to be able to eat on both sides of my mouth um, and overall a very positive experience. I would say, um, I know, you know, we had to have this done privately because it's not easy to get this done uh, any other way. Um, I would say it's definitely made my whole eating experience a hell of a lot better and I'm, I'm glad that I went for the decision and chose to have it done.